lecture i am going to factorize 4x power 4 plus 7x square minus 2 so here let's see the answer first writing the given 4x power 4 plus 7x square minus 2 so here first we need to multiply first term with the last term so writing 4x power 4 into minus 2 so it come minus 8x power 4 then write the middle term 7x square so 7x square we need to break into two parts so let's write here 6x square plus x square so it's equal to 7 and when you multiply 6x square into x square that equal to 6x power 4 so these two are not the same so we cannot take this combination so let's try another way so this time I'm going to take here 8x square minus x square if you subtract it equal to 7x square and now multiply then it come here minus 8x power 4 so both these two are same equal so we can take this combination so writing here 4x power 4 this here 8x square minus x square minus 2 take the common 4x square this here x square now this you get 2 then take minus common here x square plus 2 x square plus 2 is the common so write x square plus 2 now here 4x square minus 1 now we can write x square plus 2 then after this we can write 2x whole square and now 1 square so 2x whole square that is equal to 4x square and now 1 square that is 1 after that suppose this is a here this is b a square is there between minus is there so a square minus b square that is a plus b a minus b so we can write this one x square plus 2 a plus b that is 2x plus 1 a minus b 2x minus 1 so this is the answer or factorization of this equation so this is the first way we can do the factorization let's see the another way so another way that i'm going to show you so let's open now this time writing the given once again 4x power 4 7x square minus 2 let assume x square equal to y so we can write here 4x square okay into x square or you can write 4x square whole square this here 7x square minus 2 so for in place of x square put y so this here y square this here y minus 2 and in the side write x square equal to y after that multiply these two so for y square into minus 2 this come here 8 y square take the middle term 7 y we can write 8 y minus y and if you multiply 8y minus y it equal to minus 8y square these two are same same with then we can take this one so here 4y square and this here 8y minus y minus 2 take the common 4y so this here y plus 2 this here y plus 2 y plus 2 is the common and this here 4y minus 1 after that put the value of y assume x square so writing here 
x square plus 2 this here 4x square minus 1 now x square plus 2 this we can write 2y whole square this here minus 1 whole square so a plus b a minus b we can write x square plus 2 a plus b 2y plus 1 2y minus 1 so this is the factorization so this is the second way we can do the factorization of this equation you can try anyway the most important important thing the understanding choose anyway then you can do the factorization so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you